Hello, good evening. How are you? Fine, teacher. Fine. Okay. So, what about your day? How was it? Tiring? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. So, how was it? Tiring. Tiring? Exhausting? Okay. So, let's see. Uh, good evening, Carlos, Alfredo, Edwin, Paola, Elizabeth, Claudia. Good evening, Good evening, teacher. Okay. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Okay, guys. So we are going to start with today's class, and I'm going to share my screen so you can see. Uh, let me just allow me one second. Yes, there we go. Okay, guys, so we're going to start with today's class, and today we are going to start with the following quote. Erika, help us reading the quote. The secret to real success is enthusiasm. 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 Perfect, like that. Yes, so the secret to real success, success means éxito. So the secret to real success is enthusiasm. El secreto real para el éxito es el entusiasmo. All right? So good it evening. depends on how you do things. Good evening, Carlos. Okay, depende de cómo haga las cosas. Si las hace con entusiasmo, las hace porque ni modo. Okay? Yes, entusiasmo. Entusiasmo. The secret to real success is enthusiasm. All right. So then we are going to start with today's agenda. We have the warm up. Then we are going to move to vocabulary. We have grammar. We have practice time, of course. We have exercises and we have the wrap up. So as we mentioned yesterday, guys, uh, today we are going to start with guess the movie. Yes, as we mentioned yesterday, that is going to be the warm up that we are going to have. Guess the movie. So I need to Can you put it? Uh -huh. Two volunteers, dos voluntarios para irse a otra sala y los que nos quedemos vamos a describir la película. Two volunteers. Ajá. Who wants to guess? ¿Quién quiere adivinar las películas? Nobody. Nobody wants to guess. Ariel, okay. So Ariel, I'm going to send you to a different room and I need another one. Let me see, assign manually. Okay, so Ariel is one and I need another one. Who? Nobody wants to guess. Nadie quiere adivinar, todos quieren describir. Okay, Carlos. I, I feel skept skeptical. <laughs> No, Carlos, okay? So would you like to guess or describe? Would you like Pardon to me? or describe? ¿Quiere describir um, o adivinar? Describe it. Describe. Okay. Uh, Claudia, would you like to guess or describe? ¿Qué quiere? ¿Adivinar o describir? Describe. Describe. Oh my God. Okay, Ariel, I think that you are the only one that is going to guess. Okay. Today, todos van a participar describiendo. Todos. All right. All of you. Yes. Okay. So, Ariel, I'm going to send you to a different room for one minute. Okay. And then I'm going to call you back. Okay. 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 All right. So, guys, the ones that uh, are going to describe that. We are almost all, right? So, casi todos. Bye. Okay, let me see. Let me see si ya está Ariel en las... Yes. Okay, ya se fue Ariel. Okay, guys. So, we are going to describe the movies. I have... Let me see. Give me one second. I have some movies. Tengo algunas movies aquí. Usted me dice si agregamos o quitamos. Okay. Vamos, I have, yes, I have... I have Titanic. I have Shrek. I have Hulk, I have Minions, I have Transformers, I have Venom or Venom, Moana, and Lord of the Rings. Those eight movies. Would you like me to add more? Another one? Or those two, four, six, eight? 
eight movies. Okay. Teacher so, could, uh -huh. could be uh, mascotas. Las mascotas. Sería como pets, ¿verdad? Yeah, pets. Okay, pets. Okay. What else? Just that. Okay, so here we go. Eh, son nueve. Okay, son nueve. Entonces, the Avengers. The Avengers. Okay, vamos a ponerle también The Avengers. Cars. Which one? Cars. Which one, Juan? Cars. Cars. Mm -hmm. Okay. Ok, remember, we cannot say the name of the movie. No podemos decir el nombre de la película, o sea, el título. No, no podemos decir Cars, ¿verdad? Tenemos que describir la película, ¿sí? Entonces, todos vamos a participar. The Secret, ok, The Secret Life of Pets. Ok, that is the name. La vida secreta de las mascotas, right? Vaya. Ok, guys. Todos vamos a participar. Todos. All of us. Entonces... Eh, Jael, you are going to start. Jael, usted va a describir the first one. You are going to describe number one, Jael. Yes, Paula. Teacher, how do you take carrera? How do you take race? How do you say carrera? Mm -hmm. Race? Mm, car. Uh -huh. La película es cars, pero para decir carrera. <laughs> race. Uh -huh. race. Race. Uh -huh. okay. Sí. Okay. So no solo cars, uh -huh. solo race. Okay. Okay. So, uh -huh. What does mean racing? Racing as well. Yes. It's carrera too. Yes. Racing. Okay. Uh, uh, yes. How, how do you say rayo? Rayo? Rayo is thunder. Oh? Thunder or lightning. I'm going to. Rayo. Uh, light, lightning. Eh, thunder. También es trueno. Rayo, trueno. Lightning, thunder. Mm -hmm. Okay. So all of you are going to describe, okay? Todos le vamos a describir a Ariel, todos, okay? So let me bring Ariel. Jael, usted va a comenzar, okay? With Titanic, okay? So Jael, you start, then Erika, Shrek, okay? You Shrek, Erika, eh, Hulk, Carlos Alfredo, usted va a describir Hulk, okay? Uh, Minions, Edwin. Edwin, you minions. minions. Elizabeth, Transformers. Eh, Carlos Ernesto, uh, Venom. Juan Antonio, Cars. Porque se dijo Cars, ¿ok? Cars, ¿ok? Eh, Claudia Moana. Yes. Jonathan, Lord of the Rings. Lord of the Rings, Jonathan. Eh, Paola, The Avengers. The Avengers, Paula. Marvin. Teacher. Yes. Teacher, esa película no sé cuál es. The Avengers. Vaya, ¿cuál se sabe? Lo más es esas cars. Las que acaban de decir, pero esa sí no sé cuál es. Eh, se sabe. Eh, Frozen. Se la cambio por Transformers. ¿Transformers? ¿Se la puede? Sí, Vaya. Transformers. ¿Transformers? Yeah, más o menos. Ok. So, so. All right. Transformers y Paula. En Elizabeth, entonces, uh, the, Avengers. the Avengers. The Avengers. The Avengers. Marvin, okay. you are going to describe uh, Batman. Ok. Yes. Uh, let me see. Isela, are you there? Um, no, no sé cuál es esa teacher. No, ok, ahí está Solo le pregunté que si estaba ahí, pero ahí está Pensé que no estaba Isela Bye. Eh, Isela, usted va a describir eh, Una película que se le haga fácil 
Hector, are you there? Hola, hola. Yes. Are you busy? Está ahí, Hector. Rafael. Well, Isela, you are going to describe um, oh, El Grinch. Está bien. Yes. Hector, you are going to describe um, let me see. Another one that is easy. Teacher. Yes. Yo en los minions solo voy a decir banana. <laughs> banana, <laughs> jello. Okay. Mm -hmm. eh, Hector, let me see. Black Panther. Black Panther is is, is really common. Okay. All right. Let me call Ariel. Okay. Vaya. Ya se sabe su película. Okay. Vamos a llamar a Ariel. Okay. So first is Cela. Sorry. First Jael. Then Erika. Yo voy llamándolos uno por uno. Okay. Teacher. Yes. ¿Cuál es la el cómo quisiera decir este el, la dinámica porque voy entrando no no he entendido mucho oh you are going to describe va a describir la película que le dije okay mm -hmm. okay ah uh, let me see no it's not here he's not here let me see Ariel Ariel yes Ariel Estoy. very good okay Ariel we are going to start describing the movie okay Clarice, ya le voy a mandar la suya. Give me one second, okay? So, Ariel. Ay, me hace el favor de en medio explicarme, por favor. Yes, okay. porque creo que no está, pero ya lo voy a explicar. Vaya, Ariel. Sí, por favor. So, we are going to start, and the first one is going to be Jael. Okay, Ariel, va a tener nada más dos minutos, las que pueda adivinar en dos minutos, okay? So, okay. go. Jael. Uh, uh, the bot, the bot is thinking. The boat, uh, ocean, uh, ocean, much, much, much sea. Okay. Uh, tell the boat in the ocean. In the ocean. Uh, uh -huh. Tell the genre. Titanic. Dígale el género. Oh, yes. Or, yes, Titanic. Yes, Titanic. Erika, Erika. Okay. The movie is about a uh, cartoon. Mm -hmm. the, the actor is green. And Nick, his friend is a donkey and a cat. Is a donkey and a cat. Are his friend. He lives alone in a swamp. He's green. Mm -hmm. Green. Uh... He married with a princess. Uh -huh. Mary with princess. Green, 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 green. So uh, uh, listen I to the to the characters. Escuch los personajes. A princess, a cat, a donkey. Uh -huh. uh, Erika uh, mentioned the uh -huh. color. Yeah. The color of the characters. Uh, I don't know. I mean, Erika, you mentioned the color of the characters. Its character, the, the main character is green. Mm -hmm. Second is gray. Mm -hmm. And the cat is orange. Uh -huh. Ariel? Orange. <laughs> oh my cat, God. Uh, he wears boots. Uh -huh. Ariel. I don't know. The cat wears boots. He lives in a town that is far, far, far away. 
Ariel Comón. Ah, Shrek. Yes, ok. Carlos Alfredo, go. Ok. Es uh, green. Is green. Ok. Is green. Uh, storm. Strong. Strong. Okay. Furious. Furious, ok. Green, gre strong, furious. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Y grat, grat, gray. Gray, ok. So, Ariel, the character is green, strong, furious. The person is big. Is big, yes. Uh, Hulk? Yes. Yes. Yes, oh. Edwin Ernesto, your turn. Yeah. Okay. They are small. They are small. Okay. Yellow creatures. Yellow creatures. Uh, weeks on or two edges on their face and have weeks only three fingers. Three fingers. Okay. So they are yellow. Ariel? They are small. They are small. They are yellow. Yellow. They are funny. It is um a funny movie, I think. But it's a movie for kids. Recuerde decir el género para que le ayude más a Ariel. Okay. So it's a movie. It is a movie for kids. They are small. Yellow. They only have one eye. Oh no, right. They have two eyes. Yes. Tiene un ojo y dos. No. Uh, yes, right. Uh -huh. Some of them, some of them have one eye, and others they do have two eyes. Uh. It is a movie for kids, Ariel. Um, oh, 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 the person is yellow, okay? Yellow? Yellow. Uh, small? Banana, minions. <laughs> minions, <laughs> yes, very good. Uh, Carlos Ernesto Sarceño, excellent, Ariel. Carlos Ernesto Sarceño. Hello, teacher. Uh, the description of the, the movie is, uh, for example, he looks like um, aliens or something like that. Um, okay. He is a, he is a more pa para parasite than human. Okay. Um, the other one is, um, mm, okay. he is a, a bad copy of a, um, a superhero. Mm -hmm. And he is a anti-hero. Uh -huh. He's, uh, he uh, she, he is a uh, 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 the color black, mm -hmm. maybe. Uh, I repeat the, the last one. Uh, he is a bad copy of of the hero. Mm -hmm. Yes, uh, I don't know. Um, he is a okay. black. He is black. I'm, I mean, the costume, right? The he is costume, black. Yes, he's black. Um, I think that he is from Marvel. Yeah, I okay. think. Uh, he is a hero? No, he is not a hero. No. He is a, a villain. Anti hero. Yes, an anti hero. He looks like an alien. Uh huh. He's black. He's black, yes. Um, let's see. Um, he 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 have a, a, a lot of a lot of tea or, or two. Mm -hmm. Can you repeat or me? two t-shirt? Repeat again, Carlos. 
Okay, uh, he looks like an alien. He looks like he, an alien. Yes, he is more parasite than human. Okay, okay. He is an anti-hero. He is an anti-hero, okay. It is a bad copy of um, a hero. <laughs> uh -huh. Yes. Uh, I don't have idea. Okay, so you know, um, okay, it's, it's like a copy of a Spider-Man. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> Venom. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay, all right. So, Juan Antonio. Okay, my education movie is in the speed. This movie is about speed, okay. Race. Race, okay. Fast. And fast. Thunder, thunder, algo, algo así creo que. Okay, and the colors. Describe los colores. Is a movie live person or cartoon? Cartoon. 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 Cartoons. Cartoons. The Cartoon. The indication in the venom is, is like a cartoon or? No. Or it's, it's, all, it's all there. That one is a real movie, I mean. Oh, okay. people, uh-huh. Okay, okay. Yes. Okay, uh -huh. thank you. Okay. Uh-huh. So the color, Art. the color. Yes. Yes. Art. Okay, cars. Very good. Claudia Maria Gonzalez. Okay, go, Claudia. Mm, okay. Mm, the movie characters is... Mm, she is love the ocean. She loves the ocean. She lives on um island. Okay, she lives on an island. Mm. Island. She lives on uh, a lake. <laughs> island. Island. Very good. Mm. Her friend is a chicken. Okay. Ah, oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Which movie? Which movie, Ariel? Uh, Okay, she's pay me more. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, so she she loves the ocean. Okay. Um her friend is a chicken. Uh -huh. I think it's Moana. Yes, very good. Excellent. Jonathan. We cannot hear you, Jonathan. The microphone. Uh, is an epic high fantasy novel. Mm -hmm. It is a trilogy, trilogy of three movies. The movie there are rough and gigants. Giants. Giants. Yes. Uh, the villain is an ace. His name is Sauron. Okay. <laughs> I know. I, I I don't have idea. Uh, mm. I there are remember are... see a movies with gigants. Giants. Giants. Oh, okay. Giants. Yes. yes. Um. Everyone fight for a ring. Uh huh. Everyone fights for a ring. Uh, but it's a movie, right? Really? Yeah, it is a movie. Uh, mm -hmm. And it has, a, as he said, a trilogy. It's very common. The, hero, the heroes that movie are draft. He hasn't seen it. No la he visto, he hasn't seen it. No. Okay. All right, Jonathan, say. Say which the was the movie. What? Diga cuál es, cuál es la, la película. The Lord of the Rings. The Lord of the Rings. Ariel, have you seen that movie? No, I don't see. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay, don't worry. Elizabeth, your turn. The Lord of the Rings. Yes, Elizabeth. 
the genre of the movie is science fiction. Um, destructive. Destructive. No sé cómo se pronuncia. Destructive. Destructive. Woman and man. Star. Um, captain. Uh -huh. Superhero. Superhero. This movie is Superhero. also from Marvel. Ah, uh, the movie uh, has a team. Yes. Okay, Avengers. The Avengers. Very good. Okay. Yes. Okay, so then we're going to stop right here. Vamos a dejarlos aquí. Vamos a continuar con la clase y después vamos a volver a, al game. Okay, but right now, let's move. Let's move. Okay, so let's see. We are going to start with vocabulary. Rooms in the house. Paola, where is mom? Where is mom? Where is mom according to this picture? Where is mom? Where is mom? Is she is in the dining room? Dining room. Dining room. Dining room. Excellent. Yeah. Okay. So pronunciation, this is for everybody. Okay, this is for everybody. We have bedroom. Bed bedroom. Bathroom. 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 Living room. Living, Living room. room. Dining room. Dining room. Dining room. Kitchen. 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 And garden. And garden. And garden. Where is brother? Where is brother? Bathroom. He is in the bathroom. He is in the bathroom. He is. And where is dad? He is in the kitchen. He is in the kitchen. In the and kitchen. where is sister? He is in the, he is in the she bathroom. She is in the bathroom. Bathroom. And where bathroom. is baby? He is, he is in the living room. room. He is in the living room. And where is grandma? She is in the bedroom. She is in the bed. She is in the bed. And where is She's grandpa? In he is in the garden. He is in the garden. Very good. Okay, so mom is the same as saying mom or mother. Okay, we also have brother, dad, or father, sister, baby, grandma, or grandmother. Grandpa or grandfather? Okay. Grandfather. grandfather. Abuelo. Yes. Abuelo. Correct. Yes. Okay. Let's move. Vocabulary. Grandfather. Go to work. Abuelo. Correct. Yes. Grandpa is abuelo. Okay. Guys, how do you go to work? How do you go to work? ¿Cómo va al trabajo? Eso significa esto. How do you go to work? How do you go to work? So if I ask you, si yo le pregunto, right? If I ask you, how do you go to work? ¿Cómo me va a responder? I go to work by car. I go to work by taxi. I go to work by bus. I go to work by bike. I go to work by motorcycle. Or I go to work on foot. A pie. Teacher, for me, is I go to work in car. No, it's I go bus. to work by car. By car. By car. Okay. Teacher, disculpe que le interrumpa. Worrying. Y así es de, este, de letreados, eh, que me equivoco con, con la escritura. Um, ¿Cuál palabra? Eh, worrying. Dice, how do you worry? Go. Oh. How do you go to work? Ajá. Ajá. ¿Cuál es la pregunta que me dice? Este, como la, para, o sea, para letrearlos, eh, la palabra, worry. Worry. Work. 
Oh, huh? W O R R K. 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 Yes. Y ahí, después de su K. That's Creo it. que lo que ella quiere saber es cómo vamos a responder, cómo se escribe toda o la sea, oración. Ah. I worry, no, the spell, the spell, the, the other Work, yes. Uh -huh. W-O-R-K. K, ajá, solamente. Yes. Y ahí, go. Después, ok. I no. Ok, so, va a decir para responder, I go to work by, y dice el medio de transporte con el que usted va. Ok, ok, ok. Ok, thank you. Thank All right. you. All right, thank you. All right, so I go to work by taxi. I go to work by bus. I go to work by car, by bike. El medio de transporte que usted utilice. Pero si usted va a pie, usted va a decir, I go to work on foot. Claudia. El tú no se pronuncia mucho. Oh, el tú lo puede pronunciar, um, por ejemplo, how do you go to work? Puede decirlo así, sin embargo, para que usted se vaya acostumbrando a la pronunciación norteamericana, la T se hace una R. Entonces suena como how do you go to work? How do you go to work? How do you go to work? ¿Cuál suena mejor? How do you go to work? O how do you go to work? Incluso la D suena como una R. También. Pero esa es más que todo pronunciación. ¿Sí? Pero para que se vaya adaptando, es importante que lo empecemos a hacer desde el inicio bien. ¿Ok? So, how do you go to work? How do you go to work? Or puede hacer como la D normal, how do you go to work, como usted quiera. O pronunciarlo así, how do you go to work. Correcto también, no hay ningún problema, es cuestión de gusto. ¿Ok? Very good. Eh, Jonathan, how do you go to work? I go to work on foot. On foot? Oh my God. So that is so near. Okay. Carlos Ernesto, how do you go to work? I go to work by car teacher. Excellent. Carlos Alfredo Reyes, how do you go to work? I do, I do work, work uh, by bus. By bus. By bus. Yes. Edwin, how do you go to work? Uh, I go to work uh, by motorcycle. Excellent. Uh, Marvin. Uh -huh. Yes. Marvin, how do you go to work? Oh, you are muted. Está silenciado. Sorry. Uh, I go to work by, by bus. By bus. By bus. Sorry. Yes. Perfect. Victor, how do you go to work? I go to work on foot. On foot as well. Oh my God, that is so near. Ariel and you, how do you go to work? Sí, me queda como cinco I, minutos. Okay. <laughs> All right. I go to work on foot. On foot as well. Oh my God, you are so lucky. Okay, let's see. Paola, how do you go to work? How do you how I do go. you work on foot? Oh, I go to work. I go to work on foot. Paola, you as well? Oh my God, so lucky. It's a, how do you say 15 minutes? It's 15 minutes away from home. It's 15 minutes away. away. Away from home. From home. Yes. You are so Teacher. lucky. You are fortunados. You are so lucky. <laughs> Teacher. Yes. I go How to do work. You go to work? I work from home. 
con. Yes, I work from home. Yo trabajo desde casa. Okay? Ah, home, home office. Con usted home home. más afortunada. Home. <laughs> yes, right. Okay. Call to bus. Ajá. Uh -huh. Clarixa, how do you go to work? Uh, I go to work by bus. Excellent. Very good. Yes. Okay. Excellent. Okay. Okay. Um, Juan, how do you go to work? I go to work by bus. My bus, okay. Isela, what about you? How do you go to work? I go to work on um, foot. Excellent. Erika, what about you? How do you go to work? I go to work by bus. My bus, okay. Claudia, what about you? How do you go to work? I, I, pardon. <laughs> I go to work. And the laptop for my bus. Hi, um, bus or foot. or on foot. foot. Oh my god, really? Okay. Okay. And you, Rafael, are you there? How do you go to work? No, he is not there. Anna? Hello? Okay, Rafael, how do you go to work? I go. You my work by car. By by car, okay. Okay. Anna, are you I, there? Well, I didn't know. Okay, I, let's move. How do you go to work? Yes, how do you go to work? Okay. What are their jobs? What are their jobs? What about this one? What is his job he's a doctor he's a doctor what is her job uh, he's a policeman no policeman he's a police woman ah police woman okay yes police. what about don't worry what about this one what is his job he's waitress. a waitress he is a waitress and waitress. what about her job She's a sales person. Sales person. Yes, she's sales a person. sales person. Excellent. What about her job? Um, she's a teacher. She is a teacher. Yes. She. Okay. So, what about his job? What is his job? He's an actor. He's an actor. He's an actor. In her job. She's she an, is actress. an actress. An actress in his an job. She's a financial financial analyst. No? Financial analyst. Something like that. Okay. Or oh, it could be that he is a writer because he is typing. Esa como escribiendo. Maybe un escritor. I don't know. Yes. What about her job? She is a teacher. Uh, not exactly. Supervisor. No. Supervisor. Okay. Um. Uh, okay. So. She is a boss. Entrenadora. Okay. A trainer. A boss. A supervisor. Okay. Okay. Could be. Yes. Okay. Yes. Yes, I, I can tell you that, yes. Uh, probably she is a waitress. Camarero, mesero, waiter, y mesera es waitress, okay? Waiter, mesero, waiter. Y mesera, waitress, okay? What about his job? Maybe she is a shipper. He. He is a shipper. He's a chief. Chip shipper. Uh, it's like a uh, learn to Bible or explain a Bible oh, wow. or something like that. Oh, okay. All right. Or he is a lawyer. A lawyer. Oh, lawyer. A lawyer. Yeah. A lawyer. And what about her job? She is a nurse. Nurse. In this one? Um, she is a 
Bartender. 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 Very good. Okay. Excellent. Let's continue. Let's continue. But before continuing, I'm going to take attendance. Attendance. Okay. Attendance. Here we go. Ana Gladys Vanegas. Ana Gladys. Okay. Araceli del Carmen Vigil González. Okay. Ariel Ernesto Morales. Present. Thank you. Carlos Alfredo Reyes. Present. Thank you. Carlos Ernesto Sarceño. Here I am, teacher. Thank you. Clarixa Maribel Ramos. Present, teacher. Thank you. Claudia Maria González Oporto. Present, teacher. Thank you. Edwin Ernesto Aguilar Gutierrez. Present teacher. Thank you. Elizabeth Joana Herrera. Present. Thank you. Erika Joana Aquino. Present. Thank you. Hector Alberto Castillo. I am here. Thank you. Isela Jamilet de Morales. Present. Thank you. Jael Elizabeth Cárcamo. Present. Thank you. Jonathan Astrubal Herrera. Present. Thank you. Juan Antonio Alvarado. Thank you. Luisa Tatiana Castillo. Luisa. Luisa Tatiana. Ok. Eh, Marina Elizabeth Alfaro Castro. No. Ok. Marvin Oswaldo Herrera. Present teacher. Thank you. Paola Melisa Fuentes Alvarado. Present teacher. Thank you. And Rafael Antonio Vázquez Mejía. Present teacher. Thank you. Okay, guys, let's continue. And now we are going to move to more vocabulary. Do you remember about WH questions? Do you remember about WH? So today we have more information about WH. Okay, so let's see. So we have to match. Tenemos que enlazar. Why? So cuando hablamos de why, ¿para qué lo utilizamos? Para choice? preguntar. ¿Por qué? Para preguntar. ¿Por pregunta, qué? ¿Por qué? ¿Por qué? Te pregunto. Why literal. Why. Literal para qué. What's a time? A rezo. A rezo. A rezo. No. Very good. Repeat after me and say reason. Reason. A rezo. A rezo. Yes. Very good. When. Now when. When. A time, day, or year. Okay, a time, day, or mm -hmm. year. A Excellent. time, for, a time day, or Cuando. Where, a place. When. A place. Very good. How? How? Uh, a method or manner? A method or manner? A method or manner. How? De una, una manera o un método. Well, today you are going to develop something. Van a desarrollar algo que tiene que ver con how. Van a desarrollar how do you make the perfect cup of coffee. Cómo hacer la taza de café perfecta. Okay? Van a desarrollar eso. So, which? Which? A choice. Which? A choice. Very good. A choice. Una elección. Very good. Who? A person. What's the name of choice? A person. A person. A, person. a choice means elección. Ah, oh, okay. Okay, thank you. Who's? A thing or activity. Choice. Um, no. The other. Who's? Other. Who's? Yes. The owner. The owner. Guys. The of owner. Who's means ¿De quién? ¿De quién? So, si yo el, quiero decir, el dueño. El dueño, ajá, correct. The owner. Si yo quiero decir, ¿de quién es este borrador? Ajá. Whose eraser is this? ¿De quién es este borrador? ¿De quién? The owner, el propietario. Owner. And what a thing or activity? Right. What do you do every day? 
una actividad. What do you do every day? Yes. Questions. Questions or doubts? No. No, right now? No, right now. Okay, let's move. Teacher. Yes. In this case, in this structure, the, we don't insert uh, the other structure about uh, auxiliar, like auxiliar? No, on this one, no. Okay. Well, el auxiliar, the auxiliary verb is is. Okay. Do, does, do? No. Never. No. Okay. Yes. Okay, thank you. Okay, very good. Let's move. Types of work places. Los lugares de trabajo. Types of work places. Okay, number one. Number one. What is number one? Is it a call a center? Is it center. an open center. office? A, open is office. It a closed office? Closed office. No. What what is the first picture, guys? Where do you? It cannot be a call center because look at this one. This call is center. La cuatro. Yes, call center is number four. Call center mm -hmm. is number four, but number one is not a call center. Uh. Entonces sería an open, open office. An open office. An open, an open office. office. Yes. Do you work o in an, an open, open office? Office. Do you work in an open office? An open office. No, I don't. No, I don't. Okay. All right. So what about this one, number two? What is number two? Close office. Close office. Close office. Um, open office. Yes. office. I, do you work in a closed office? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Number three. Yes, I do. A factory. A factory. A factory. A factory. Do a factory. you work in a factory? No. No. No, I don't. No, she don't. does. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Okay. No, so, she does. No, she does. No, she doesn't. No, she doesn't, perdón. Yes. Sorry, okay? Call, call, call center. center. No, she doesn't. Yes. Call center. Call center or call center. La T se quita y se dice nada más call center. Call center. Call center. Do center. you work in a call center? No, right? But no, no, she doesn't. No, I don't. Ay, perdón. I no, don't. I don't. No, I don't. Yes, Marisa. Okay, no. what about <laughs> number five? What about number five? Number five. A warehouse. A warehouse. A warehouse. Do you work in a warehouse? Do you work in a warehouse? A retired outfit. Okay, what is the meaning of a warehouse, guys? What is the meaning of a warehouse? Bodega, teacher. Bodega, okay. So, and the last one is a retail outlet, okay? Retail, a retail outlet. Yes, this is a retail outlet, yes. Uh, they really appear to supermarkets like that. It is, yes, it is, it is the same. It is the same. It is a supermarket. It is a supermarket. Okay. It okay. is the same. A retail outlet guys, es un lugar donde le venden por menor. I mean, ventas por menor. Como un supermercado. Okay? Okay. Like super selectos. Okay? Son ventas por menor. So, sí, sí, pero... When I say uh, I go to retail outlet, mm -hmm. you you means you you understand. I understand, but the thing is that uh, this one is not common. That's why we have a supermarket. Okay. Yes, this is more um, 
technical vocabulary. Oh, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. But the common one is supermarket. Okay. Yes. Okay. Very good. Okay, let's move. Okay. Let's see. Where do you usually find these workplace things? Let's see. In an office, what can we find in an office? From those words. Uh, Number four. A, a, desk. Desk. a, a printer. A, a monitor. A monitor. A Xerox machine. A Xerox machine. A Xerox machine. A Xerox in a, a cafeteria? A table. A water cooler. Okay, a water cooler, a table. A cash table, a tray. A tray, a tray. Yes, la bandeja. La bandeja. A tray. Yes. Do you know what is a Xerox machine? ¿Sabe lo que es una Xerox machine? For a copy. A photocopier, right? Photocopier. Yes. Para los que no saben lo que es una Xerox machine, is this, okay? This one is a Xerox machine. Impresora. Impresora. Fotocopiadora. Fotocopiadora. Yes. Okay. That is a, a Xerox machine. Now, water cooler. If I may say, this is a water cooler. Okay. In a factory, what can we find in a factory? A machine. A robot. Okay, a machine. A robot. A robot. A machine. A machine. A machine. A machine. In a store. A printer, a, a price tag, a, a, price tag. a, a cash, price tag. Price. A a cash, cash register. register, cash register, cash, cash, cash register, shelves. What means shelves, teacher? Shelves means estantes, los shelves. Uh, okay, shelves. Mm -hmm. oh, estantes. Very good. Excellent. Okay, guys. Now let's match the verbs on the left with the nouns on the right. Okay. The so let's see. On the right. Yes. Let's match. Okay. Let me okay. see. Let's do it together. What can you sing? You sing? Contracts. Well, in this case, no. This one is sign. Give me one second, okay? Yes, now yes. No podía ver. Okay, this one is sign, okay? You sign a contract, okay? Contract. You sign a contract. Yes, you sign a contract. Usted firma. Firma contrato. Contrato. Firma. Sign. Contrato. Sign contract. Sign contract. Sign contract. Firma contract. Drink coffee. 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 Operate a uh, machine. A machine. Yes. Uh, machine. Yes. Opera, machine. Una, una, okay. yes. Yes. Operate a machine. Receive phone calls. Phone calls. Take, calls. Take, take a break. Take a break. Take Toma a un break. Descanso. Toma take un a break. Take a break. Attend. Problem. No. no. A, conference. A, conference. A, conference. A conference. A conference. Very A good. Conference. And you fix? ¿Qué arregla? Fix? Problems. 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 Very good. Problems. And you serve? Customers. Customers. Now repeat after me. Sign contracts. Sign contracts. Sign contracts. Drink coffee. Drink coffee. Operate a machine. Operate a machine. Receive phone calls. Receive phone calls. Receive a break. Customer. 
take, take a, break. A, break. a break. Attend a conference. Attend, Attend a, a conference. A conference. A conference. A conference. Fix problems. Fix problems. Serve customers. Serve, Serve customers. Customer. Customer. Do you it's have the, any question? The last one I, I, I don't listen. So, what's the answer? Oh, oh. No, serve means servir, atender. Atender a los clientes? A los oh. clientes. Ah, okay. okay, thank you. Yes, atender a los clientes. Usted los asiste, ¿verdad? Los Teacher, customer is equal to aduana. No, aduana is uh, custom. Custom? Yes. Ah, okay. But it's similar, right? O sea, yes. se dicen las palabras. Yes, I know yes. it's similar. Yes. Okay. Custom. Yes. Okay. Any other doubt? ¿Alguna palabra? ¿Alguna duda de algún vocabulario de acá? Pronunciación, pronunciation. Eh, a fix. Fix, disculpe. Fix. Fix es fix. arreglar. Fix es arreglar. Yes. Solventar, sure. arreglar. Yes. Okay, gracias. Thank fixture. you. Which one? Fixture and, and you add to work fix. Uh, T U R S. Fixture. Yeah, fixture. Mm. Is maybe to arreglar something or? No, no. Fixture is different. You will see. Yes. Fix también es reparar. Reparar, sí. yes. es lo mismo, ajá. Son sinónimos. Picture. Yes. Ok, so un picture could be um, un elemento fijo. Un encuentro. Esto es para los deportes. It's like a match. Like a match. Es como, un, son como los encuentros. Miren aquí. If you notice, están como los encuentros de todos los grupos. A, B, C, D, E, F. Esos son encuentros. Mm, para deportes. Picture. Uh, but, but I can say Qatar fixture Inglaterra or something. Eh, like yes, you can say it. Okay. Sí, lo puede decir. Okay, thank you. Picture. So, very good. All right. Where do you see that word? ¿Dónde vio esa palabra, Carlos? Eh, justo en una, eh, eh, en, en, la, en la TV. Uh, watching TV mm -hmm. sport. Football soccer. Puede decir también de esta manera. Mire, the fixture, o sea, el encuentro, the fixture between Qatar and Spain. To Spain, okay. Yes, but puede así, se lo voy a escribir acá para que lo tengan en cuenta, okay? Okay. Uh, you can say something like this. The picture, el encuentro, the picture between, entre, between Qatar and Spain. The fixture, oh, okay. The fixture, el encuentro. Yes. How can I say uh, la inauguración entre entre el partido de España y Qatar? No sé. Um, I would say something like the inauguration. Inauguration. Ah. Uh, yeah. between Qatar and, and which was the other one? Spain. La inauguración, uh -huh. the, the inauguration between Qatar and Spain. Pero ya no entra el fixture. No. Okay. Recuerde que estamos como interpretando, ¿verdad? Entonces, hay okay. muchas maneras de decirlo. Yeah, many, sí. many, many ways. Okay. okay. Thank you, Tish. All right. Very good. Let's move, let's continue, okay? So now, uh, well, we already covered this one, okay? Right now, let's see, let's complete this one. Let's complete the text about Alan, 
Okay, my name is Alan. I'm from the United States, but I live in Tokyo. I'm a journalist. What is a journalist? Is a, a presentador de noticias. Okay, un periodista. Un periodista. Mm -hmm. So, I, ¿qué va aquí? I work. I work. Very good. I work. Uh -huh. I work for what? Dice que trabaja para. I work for an English language magazine. Una revista. Magazine. Magazine. Yes. And I. Right. right. I write right. about what? Right. About life in Japan. In Japan. Mm. I wake up. I get up. Get up. I get up. Okay. I get up. I get up. Um, I get up. I get up. I get up. I get up. Temprano. I get up early at seven o'clock. Seven o'clock. Hmm. Seven. Have breakfast. Have breakfast. Desayuno. Have breakfast. Have breakfast. Have breakfast. Have breakfast. Live. Um, live. I live. Live. Live home. Uh -huh. Live. And you live. Um, and they get home. Yes. Go to work. On what? Seven. I did get to home. And I, 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 I go to work. Get to work. Go to work. Go to work. Go to work. I go to work. I go to work. I, to work. I car. Okay. I, I, I go to work. I go to work. My car. I. I get home an hour later. No. No. I I live. I live. Okay. I hold. So I I live. Si digo al principio, I go to work by car. Yo voy a trabajo por, a, por medio de, de carro, sí, un carro, y después digo I. Space an hour later. Yo llego una hora después. ¿Cómo puedo decir eso? I arrive an hour later. I live. Pero de las rosadas, de las palabras que tenemos aquí. Ah. Yeah. Live. I, I get up. I live. No, I, I live. I live. Yeah. I get to work. Yo to llego work. al trabajo. I get to work. To work. Yo llego al trabajo. I get to I work. Get to work. Okay. I get to work uh, an hour later. Okay. Yo llego al trabajo una hora después. después. I get to work. My home is very far from my office. Uh, my home is very, very far from office. My I, home is very far. I finish. I finish. 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 I finish work at um, 5 o'clock. Uh -huh. I finish. Home. And? Get home. Get, get home. home. Mire, llego a la casa. And I get home. El llega a la casa, day, perdón. I go to bed late at 11 o'clock. Get home. Llegar a la casa, get home. Okay, guys. My name is Alan. I from this night. Day. Every day at 6 o'clock. Ahora leámoslo todo. Jonathan, léanos todo el párrafo ya con todos los verbos y todo, y las frases. My name is Alan. I'm from the United States, but I live in Tokyo. I am a journalist. I work for an English language M magazine. Magazine. In in magazine. magazine. Yes. In, I write about life in Japan. I grab early 
seven o'clock. Uh, have breakfast and leave home at 7.45. Mm -hmm. I go to work by car. I get to work in horse later. My home is very far from my office. I finish work at five o'clock and get home every day at six o'clock. I go to bed later at 11 o'clock. I go to bed late. I go I, to bed late. Yes, I'm going to give you, I'm going to give you four I'm going to give you? No, I'm going to give you four minutes, okay? Le voy a dar cuatro minutos para que haga su párrafo de usted mismo. Exactamente como está aquí. Exactamente como está aquí. Va a decir su nombre, de dónde es, a dónde vive, su profesión, para qué trabaja, qué es lo que hace, a qué hora se levanta, a qué hora se va de su casa, a qué hora se va para el trabajo, a qué hora llega en el trabajo, a qué hora sale del trabajo y a qué hora regresa a casa. En ese, mire, es chiquito ese pedacito, pero esa información se dice en ese par. Okay, four minutes, cuatro minutos, four minutes. If you have questions, ask. Si hay preguntas, hágalas.
teacher, which one the opposite is far? Near. N E A R. Okay, okay thank you. Teacher. Yes. I work in a city hall. Uh, city hall. Teacher. Yes. How do you say? Teacher. Publicidad. Um, agencia de publicidad. O como medio de publicidad. Ajá. Porque no somos agencias, sino que somos un medio de publicidad. Nosotros trabajamos para las agencias de publicidad. Yo trabajo en... Y escribo acerca de... Ustedes son un medio. I get up. La empresa de nosotros se dedica a, a instalar publicidad. Mm. Pero los clientes nos dan el trabajo. La agencia de publicidad contrata, este, hace, hace la venta y a nosotros nos pasan para realizarla. It's like outsourcing. It's like an outsourcing, but. Contratista. Mm. Nosotros nos llaman medio publicitario nada más. Medio publicitario. Um. Ajá. Uh -huh. uh -huh. <coughs> um, teacher. Este, yo donde dice, I, um, I work, um, ¿a dónde trabajo? Yo le he puesto que en el, yo en aldeas infantiles, ¿verdad? Pero ahí tendría que traducir, pasarlo a inglés. Ahí tendría que escribirlo. Mm -hmm. Children, uh, uh, um, el nombre de la, de la, de la aldea, aldeas children, así. Ok, no. In that case, you can use... Um, nombre propio. El name, es el nombre propio. Entonces, aldeas infantiles, así. Yes. In your case, Hector Advertising Media. Ad advertising Media. Yes, Advertising Media. ID wow. Media. Thank you, teacher. <laughs> yes. Thanks. Advertising Media. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, ready? Or no jet? No jet, teacher. No jet, okay. Ya, ya casi. Como almost, digo ya. Almost, almost done. Yeah. Uh -huh. Almost done. Yeah, okay. Okay. Okay, thank you. Almost. Ya casi sería almost done. Teacher. Yes. yes. What is the meaning also? Cuando dicen also, also. Entiendo. Also means también. Ah, ok, thank you. Mm -hmm. Also también. I get up. I, I get up. I, teacher, disculpe, eh, con la palabra I get up. I, perdón, I get to work. Esas son las horas que uno trabaja o de las horas que uno regresa. Ajá. I get to. No. I get to work. I get to work no. es a la hora que se llega al trabajo. Ah, la hora trabajo que una hora después. Ahí dice que usted llega, ajá, usted llega al trabajo una hora después. I get to work. I get to work. Um, bueno, aquí han puesto. Uh, ajá. Bye. 
Es que aquí... Ah, sí. Sí, sí, sí. Es como sí, complemento sí. de todo el... el ¿no? Sería aquí, sería el caso mío, como son dos horas de recorrido. Mm. Have, uh, I get to work um, two. Two, two later. Two hours later. Two, two hours, hours later. later. Hours. Hours, con la S. Hours. Later. Hours. Hours. Later. Uh, later. Uh -huh. Okay. Teacher, yeah. este, para decir que está muy cerca, como ahí dice, va que my home is very far. Ah, yeah. my office. Y yo, near. 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 N. N. E. A. R. A. R. Gracias. Okay. Y en dice, my house is very far from my office. Ah, yes. Ahí. Mi casa está bien lejos de, de, de la oficina. Su casa está lejos de la oficina porque se tarda dos horas usted. Sí, sí. Yes, sí. Yes. yes. My home is very far from my office. Así, como está ahí, le tiene que poner usted, Clarice. Ok, ok. Yes. No, from my office. Is is my is my very is home is very far from my office. Teacher. Yes. Teacher. Yes. I have I have a breakfast. No, it's a it's in it's in oh. no. it's a you yeah. It's a you. Correct. Desayuno. Yes. ¿Qué hora es desayuno? Yes. Cena, dinner. Ah, ok. Thank you. Okay. Yo termino a las cinco. O sea, aquí donde dice yo I finish es y él termina, finaliza yes. el trabajo a las 5. Exactly, correct. Uh, y ahí llega a la casa, get home. Exactly. Ok. Yo termino, I finish, I finish work, I finish. Ups. As five, or close. Mm -hmm. um, Anger. Um, How do you say get, um, 20 minutes después? 20 minutes later. Every day. Ellos tienen cada. Every day and o close this aquí. Eh, every, cada, todos los días o every day. Is, todos los días uh -huh. a las 6 de la tarde. Él, él llega a la casa todos los días a las 6 de la tarde. En All el right. caso de él, ¿verdad? Yes. Entonces, acá en el caso mío, yo me tardo como dos horas. Si salgo a las 5 de la tarde, che, le pongo every day um, at, a las 5. A las 5. At 7. At 7. O'clock. Solo a seven o'clock. Yes. Oh, my, permítame. O'clock. I go to bed. Ahí es la hora de cuando, a qué hora me voy a dormir. Correct. Right. Oh, go to bed. Go to bed. Okay, guys. One minute. One oh, minute. Okay. And we're done. Okay. And I, I, I would like to hear. Lo que voy a hacer oh. es que um, ahorita que vamos a terminar esto. Vamos a empezar con lo siguiente y voy a llamar a uno por uno. A uno por uno para evaluar lo que hemos hecho. Ok, a uno por uno. So, lo que vamos a hacer es lo siguiente. Vale, voy a, 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 a... Vamos a hacer, es que yo necesito que usted, obviamente, practique este con su compañero. No, voy a llamar. Okay. Luego vamos a escuchar esto. En este momento no vamos a escucharlo. 
¿sí? Porque me interesa evaluar speaking, pero lo que vamos a hacer es que usted va a practicar este diálogo. Alan and Paula. Uno va a ser Alan y el otro Paula. Y después se intercambian los papeles. Uno va a ser Paula okay. y el otro Alan. ¿Ok? So, okay. Cuando eh, ya termine esto, se va a mover con su mismo compañero que va a estar a crear este trabajo. With your partner, you are going to elaborate on the steps to prepare the perfect and share, and you are going to share, oh, you are going to share the steps with the class. So go to class number six to check on connectors of the sequence for vocabulary. How do you make the perfect cup of coffee? ¿Cómo hace la, la taza perfecta de café? Si usted me quiere hablar del té, si usted me quiere hablar de algún jugo que usted hace, de, un, de algo, de la pizza, de cualquier tipo de receta que usted haga, pero describiéndome cómo lo hace. ¿Ok? Very good. Y utilizando adverbio de secuencia. Adverbs of sequence. Cuando ya termine esto. Mientras yo llamo uno por uno para evaluar esto. ¿Ok? So, questions, preguntas. Ah, disculpe, este, ahorita que hemos terminado, que ya ha terminado lo que es nuestra rutina diaria, uh -huh. vamos a practicar con los compañeros el diálogo. Oh, yes, este. correct. Yes. Esto lo vamos a descargar con respecto a lo, al link que nos ha mandado. Yes. Sí, descarga, no, no, descarga la es. hoja de tarea. Sí, descarga su clase. Ok. Eh, let me see. Oh, Jonathan, you have two. Hola, teacher. Me, tuve problemas con el internet, me salí. Ah, ok. Rafael, are you there? Hi, Juan. Hi, teacher. Okay, I would like to listen to your paragraph. Can you please read it for me? Read the paragraph that you created. The paragraph, the paragraph. El paragrafito que estábamos haciendo. Yes, read it. Dice que no lo he terminado todavía, teacher. Okay, leame lo que tiene. Tengo, my name is Juan. Mm -hmm. I'm from the El Salvador, but like, I live in Cucatlan. Mm -hmm. I'm a cutter, cutter, creo que, o correr, no sé cómo es. Mm -hmm. I work from a fur, furniture factory, mm -hmm. then I cook the fabric for fur, furniture. Mm -hmm. I get up early at Five o'clock. Okay. At breakfast in in living home at six forty-five. I go to work by bus. I get to work in thirty minutes later. Later. 
Later. Ahí lo ok. Ah, later. Ok, perfect. Vaya. Um, ok. Ahora, observaciones. Ok. Uh -huh. eh, donde dice I am from, tiene I am from da El Salvador o tiene I am from El Salvador. El Salvador. El Salvador. Ok, muy bien. Eh, pronunciación de live. No es live, es live. 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 Uh -huh. Ok. Ok, very good. So, let me move you to a different room so you can practice. Ok, lo voy a mover para otro salón. Ok. Uh -huh. <coughs> Ten p.m. Ten p.m. Okay. Uh, uh, Ahora yo soy uh, Alan. Okay, I am Paul. Uh -huh. So, tell me about your typical day. What time do you do you get up? I get up early at seven o'clock. What time do you leave home? Uh, after I take a shower and have a breakfast, I leave home at in your club. How do you go to work? I go by train. My office is very far from my home. What time do you get to work? I get to work 90 minutes later at night 30. Do you enjoy your work? I don't, don't go to bed later. I go to bed is is 10 p.m. Vaya, ahora creo que vamos a intercambiar. Comienzo yo. No sé. Yo vi que como que se unió una compañera más. No, no. No. Hoy tú empiezas. Comienzo. So, tell me about your typical day. What I do you do? ¿Qué nos van a sacar quizá? No. Eh, ¿Cómo se pronuncia? ¿Cómo se pronuncia? 30. No, este, la palabra donde dice interesante. A people, a uh, middle uh -huh. of. Interesting. Teacher. Yes, I, I'm here, I'm here. Let me see. In Después de 90 minutos. 90 dice? 90 después, do you enjoy your work? Mm. Yes, I do, I meet. Ahí dice, yes, I do, I meet a lot of. Oh. A lot of. Interesting. 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 Interesting people. Interesting people. Personas interesantes. Teacher, teacher. Yes. How do you say 30? 30. ¿Qué? 30. 30. 30. 30. Es que esa, esa me cuesta siempre. So, okay. ¿Cómo 30. sería? Terry, ¿cómo es? Terry. 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 Como, como con Terry. Ah, con una Terry. R. Yes. T-E-R-I. Yes. Ah, Terry. 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 Yes. Con F, no va. Terry. No es con S, es que usted pone la, la lengua entre medio de los dos dientes. P. Terry. 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 Ah. Así. Ah, night 30. 
Ajá. Es que el 30 es malo. Y el 90, tío, es obvio, 6, 90. 90. Nairi. Nairi. Minute. Minute. ¿Cómo es? Minutes. Minute. Minute. Ah, minute. Ah, ahí está. I get to work 90 minutes later at 9.30. 90 minutes. Ah, por lo menos ya aprendí eso otra vez. Ya como tres veces me lo dijo la teacher, pero no se me queda. 30. <laughs> Okay, practice, okay? Don't worry. Okay. Practice, practice. Si quiere, inicio yo de nuevo. Va, de acuerdo. So, tell me about your typical day. What time do you get, get up? I get up early at 7 o'clock. What time do you leave home? After I take a shower and have a breakfast I live home I live home at eight o'clock how do you got to work I go by train my office is very far from my home what time do you get to, can you get to work Ahí vamos a pasar en un avanzado. <laughs> you don't have any question? Teacher. Yes. <laughs> Algo borrosa la, la. Está borrosa y yo tengo problemas de la vista. <laughs> ¿En serio? Sí. ¿Sí? Démosle para Carla. El, el que ve borrosa, la, 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 la letra. No sé, sea, la. La, la, el, 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 el. el... El diálogo. La diapositiva, el diálogo, la sí. diapositiva, ajá, está en, en esa parte nada más está borrosa. Mm, espérame. ¿Y si se lo mando al, 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 al WhatsApp? Vaya, está bien, dicho. Para, que, para que lo practiquen. Vale, ahorita se los mando. Gracias, eh, muy amable. Ok. Okay. Buenas noches, mamá. Bye. Okay. Ay, sí. Gran diferencia. Ah, sí, de bueno. verdad. Sí. Ah, dale. Pues soy yo, Alan, y vos, Paula. Okay. So, tell me about your typical day. What time do you get up? I got, I got up. I earn. I no, pero esta es la otra vos. No, hombre, esta es la misma. Ah. Pero ya contestada. Ah, ok. No, hombre. La no tenía de siete, bien, va. Bien, Ajá, bien. Esa, esa es la que tiene que practicar esta. Ah, la otra, la otra estamos practicando. Vale, next. Ah, dale, ah, va. What time do you leave home? After. I tie a shower and how rest by I live home I, I live home, home. H, I home. home. Mm -hmm. age and clothes. How do you go to work? How do you go to work? I will be I go by try three. My my office is very far from my home. What time do you get up to work? I get to work. Noventa. Pronuncio no. Inglés. Nighty. Uh -huh. Night. Nighty. 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 News letter. At. Nice. Yes. Dale, dale, sí. Uh -huh. Dale vos, ya. Vaya. <laughs> Do you enjoy your work? 
Yes, I do. I meet. I love all interest people. What time do you finish? Mm -hmm. I finish work at seven o'clock. It's a long day. Mm -hmm. And what time do you get? What time do you get home? I get home at seven. Eight. Eight. Thirty. What time do you go to bed? No, guru. Guru, verdad? Guru. Yes. Bed. Yes. I not go to bed late. Late. I, late. Uh -huh. I go to bed at 10. 10. PM. PM. Yes. PM. Right. Ok, so cool. now, let's move. Y ahora se va a mover a la siguiente diapositiva, donde van a crear lo de la perfecta taza de café. ¿Cómo la hace usted? Ok. Ah, pone el agua, la calienta, le pone el café, le pone crema. Sí, sí, sí. Y lo revuelve. Ok, todos esos pasos. Ok, teacher. Okay. Gracias, teacher. <laughs> ok. No sé qué es, no me acuerdo. Bien, después. Ah, aquí está la teacher, después. <laughs> Bien, después. You finish? We finish. You yes, finish? we finish. Yes, teacher. Ok, so... Allow me two minutes, okay? Because some, some of them are still uh, creating the, the recipe and everything. Yes. Okay, teacher. Okay. Allow me two minutes, okay? But I would like to listen to you and practicing the, the, the speaking time. But first, read the paragraph that you made, the paragraph about you. About? Oh, okay. Yes, read the paragraph. Erika, you go first. Okay, teacher. My name is Erika Kino. I am from El Salvador and I live in Santa Tecla. I am a receptionist. Mm -hmm. I get up at 5.30 a.m. Mm -hmm. And after I leave my home at 6.15 a.m., I go to work by bus. I get to work an hour later. Mm -hmm. And after I, at 7 o'clock, I have breakfast. And I start to work at 8 a.m. Mm -hmm. I finish to work at 5 p.m. Then I go to the gym. After I get home at 7.15 p.m. Mm -hmm. And uh, finally I had dinner. And after I have my English class. And I go to bed at 10.15 p.m. P.m. Okay. So once we finish with the class, you go to sleep, Erika. Yes, I am. Okay. Yes. Okay. That's nice. Okay. Very good. Ariel. Okay. My name is Ernesto. I'm from Salvador and I live in San Miguel. Mm -hmm. I'm a journalist. I, I get up early at seven o'clock. I had breakfast and leave home at 7 30. <laughs> I go to work on food. I get to work on one minute later. Uh, I get I get to work. Uh, perdón, me estoy equivocando. My home mm -hmm. is near from my office. I finish work at five o'clock and get home immediately. Mm -hmm. I have dinner at seven o'clock. I go to bed late at one a.m. Okay, observations. I don't know if you said have or get. I get dinner or I have dinner. I have dinner. Ah, I have. Okay, have. Okay, have. Okay, very good. So now let's practice the role play. Okay. So Ariel, you are um Paula and Erika, you are Alan. So tell me about your typical day. What time do you get up? I get up early at seven o'clock. What time do you leave home? After I take a shower and have breakfast. 
I leave home at eight o'clock. How do you go to work? I go by train. My office is very far from my home. What time do you get to work? I get to work 90 mi minutes later at 9.30. Mm -hmm. Do you enjoy your work? Yes, I do. I meet a lot of interesting people. What time do you finish? I finish work at 7 o'clock. It's a long day. And what time do you get home? I get home at 8.30. What time do you go to bed? I don't go to bed late. I go to bed at 10 p.m. Okay, very good. Now I would like to listen to your recipe. How do you make the perfect cup of coffee? Okay. Yo digo un paso y tú el otro. Okay. First, put the water in in the coffee maker. Okay. And second, we put the coffee in the cup. Okay. Okay. Third, add two tablespoons of sugar in the cup. Okay. Then we put the hot water in the in the cup with the coffee. Mm -hmm. After, add one tablespoon of cream. And finally, we mix, mix all the ingredients. Yes, very good. Excellent. And that's how you actually make it or, or no? Do you make it that way or no? Yes, uh, without the, the cream. The cream. You don't like cream? No, I don't like. <laughs> oh, and you, do you like cream? Ariel? Yes, I do. You do, yes. Okay, very good. Okay, let me call you back. Okay, let me call you back. I think that, okay. yeah, everybody must be ready. Okay. Um, okay. okay. So, Claudia, Claudia and Paola. Claudia and Paola, I would like to listen to your recipe. How do you make the perfect cup of coffee? Yes, Claudia and Paola, how do you make the perfect cup of coffee? Okay. Es que nos confundimos un poquito. Vale. Si no le hicieron, esta va a ser tarea para el jueves. Ya la hice, pero de una limonada. De la limonada. Ah, sí. Yo la hice, pero de un. Como, como preparar el pollo. Ok. Pero solo tengo un pedacito porque me faltó, vea. Pero okay. usé los dos primeros adverbios de frecuencia. Ok. Vale. Eh, Claudia, díganos cómo lo que ocurrió. Vale. Eh, sería first we eh, exprimir, squeeze, uh -huh. sí, creo que sería, the lemon into a tank. Okay. Second, and water, sugar, and ice. Sugar. Sugar. Uh -huh. uh, three, mix and serve. Uh -huh. Perfect. Yes, good. Yes, Claudia. Paola. <laughs> A ver si me entiende, teacher. Yes, of course. Why not? I always I prepare chicken with the following ingredients. Mosa, black sauce, chicken soak. And usually I like to do it either with onions or friends before that the chef, the chef, the onions, I, um, I prepare it with most, most. Uh, 
Yeah. Ahí me quedé, me faltó. Okay. Observation, prepare, prepare. Okay, prepare. Okay, volunteers. I need just one volunteer, un voluntario para describir how do you make the perfect cup of coffee? Hi, go. A mi manera, a mi manera. And then uh, the perfect lemonade. 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 Okay. I want to hear. Uh, first, cut the lemon. Okay. Second, squeeze the lemon into a glass. Yes. Third, we put water in the glass. Next, add two tablespoon, tablespoons mm -hmm. of sugar. 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 Uh, that uh, um, uh, half a uh, spoon of mint essence. Finally, add three ice cubes. Oh my God, that is delicious. That sounds delicious. That's the way that you prepare it? That's the way that you prepare it? Yes? Okay. Yes, teacher. Yes, yes. That is delicious. Oh my God. I don't do that. You add a lot of things, right? I just add the, the lemon, the sugar, the salt, and that's it. And I mix them up and that's it. But you add a uh, mint and other stuff. Okay. Very okay, good. What's, what's mean maps? Mix them up. Mm -hmm. Mix them up. Revolver. Mix. Mix. Map is M-I-M-I-P. No, it is a phrasal verb. Es un verbo phrasal. Mix up. Ah, mix up. Ah, mix up. Okay, okay, okay. Mix them up. Pero yo digo mix them up porque el them va en medio porque es de los ingredientes. Ajá. Ah, okay. Ya yes. escuché. Mix maps. Oh, no. Mix them up. Okay, okay. Thank yes. you. Edwin. Teacher, una pregunta. ¿Y cremora usted para coffee a un cremora? Um, ¿Cómo le podríamos decir? How do you say cremora? How do you say it? Estoy buscando el diccionario. Ok. Eh, let's see. ¿Quién agregó cremora al café aquí? Nadie agregó cremora. Yes. Ariel, ¿cómo do you say cremora? Cream. 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 Very good. Edwin, go. Cremora. Okay. Edwin. Cream. Cream of sugar. <laughs> okay, Edwin. Nos va a describir cómo hace su taza de café perfecta, Edwin. Y después Héctor. Ello bien sencillo. <laughs> okay. First, the sugar. Second, the coffee. Third, third the water. Me. That's it. Perfect. So you drink iced coffee. Usted se toma el café helado. You drink iced coffee. Okay. No lo calienta, nada. Es mejor así. Ok, Hector. You drink coffee. Teacher, este, I first put in in I come cafetera. Coffee maker. Ah, coffee maker, water, mm -hmm. and coffee. Mm -hmm. Seco, I white to hot, o que esté caliente. Okay. And third, servir is put mm -hmm. in, in cup. Put in the cup, okay. And later put sugar. Okay. And finish. And that's it. Sí. Okay. Very good. That was so simple as well. Okay. Somebody else I would like to share? Somebody else? <laughs> okay. Very good. Okay, guys. I'm going to play a recording. Le voy a poner un listening. El listening es este diálogo. Quiero que lo lea en, en, aquí en mi pantalla. Vea la pantalla. Le voy a poner el listening. Y cuando ellos vayan hablando, lo va leyendo usted para que escuche pronunciación. ¿Sí? 
So um, here we go. So tell me about your typical day. What time do you get up? I get up early at seven o'clock. What time do you leave home? After I take a shower and have breakfast, I leave home at eight o'clock. How do you go to work? I go by train. My office is very far from my home. What time do you get to work? I get to work ninety minutes later at nine thirty. Do you enjoy your work? Yes, I do. I meet a lot of interesting people. What time do you finish? I finish work at seven o'clock. It's a long day. And what time do you get home? I get home at eight thirty. What time do you go to bed? I don't go to bed late. I go to bed at ten p.m. Okay. Ahora quiero que se fije en la pronunciación del go to. Okay. It says I don't go to bed late. I go to bed at ten p.m. Escuche cómo pronuncian ellos las t y la d. So, tell me about your typical day. What time do you get up? I get up early at seven o'clock. What time do you leave home? After I take a shower and have breakfast, I leave home at eight o'clock. How do you go to work? I go by train. My office is very far from my home. What time do you get to work? I get to work ninety minutes later at nine thirty. Do you enjoy your work? Yes, I do. I meet a lot of interesting people. What time do you finish? I finish work at seven o'clock. It's a long day. And what time do you get home? I get home at eight thirty. What time do you go to bed? I don't go to bed late. I go to bed at ten p.m. Okay, perfect. Do you have any question about vocabulary right here? Preguntas, dudas. No. Bye. Okay. Attendance, assistance. Okay, the attendance, the attendance. Um, okay. So here we go. Ana Gladys Vanegas. Araceli del Carmen Vigil González. Ariel Ernesto Morales. Present. Thank you. Carlos Alfredo Reyes. Present. Thank you. Carlos Ernesto Sarceño. Present. Thank you. Clarixa Maribel Ramos. Clarixa. Uh, present teacher. Claudio María. Present teacher. Present teacher. Yes. Edwin Ernesto Aguilar. Present teacher. Thank you. Elizabeth Joana Herrera. Present. Thank you. Erika Joana Aguilar Hernández. Present. Thank you. Hector Alberto Castillo. I am here. Thank you. Isela Yamilet de Morales. Present. Thank you. Jael Elizabeth Cárcamo. Present. Thank you. Jonathan Herrera Lucha. Present teacher. Thank you. Juan Antonio Alvarado Mejía. Present. Thank you. Luisa Tatiana Castillo. Marina Elizabeth Alfaro. Marvin Oswaldo Herrera. Marvin. Present. Thank you. Paola Milagro Fuentes. Present teacher. And Rafael Antonio Vázquez. Present. Thank you. Excellent. Okay. Okay. So, all right. So, let's see. Let's move. And right now, before we go, antes de que nos vayamos, okay, ya casi vamos a terminar. Um, let's go ahead and practice the following. Vamos a practicar lo siguiente. Okay. This one. Unscramble the sentences. Vamos a descifrar. Yes. Let's see. Number one. This is a question. Es una pregunta. Okay. How often do you go to the gym? How often do you go to the gym? Perfect. Number two. I go. I hardly ever go to the gym. Perfect. Three. How often do you go to the gym? 
How often? How often does your teacher does your teacher drink coffee? Perfect. Number four. She drinks coffee every day. She drinks coffee every day. Number five. When do you when do you usually watch TV? Excellent. When do you usually watch TV? Very good. Number six. We in the evening sometimes watch TV. Now go on. We sometimes we sometimes we sometimes watch TV in the evening. I watch TV in the evening. Yes. Seven. Yes. Seven. Seven. Number seven. Um. Was what do what do your friends what do your friends, friends or the weekend what do your friends on the weekend what do your friends do your friends on the weekend on the weekend excellent what do your friends do on the weekend <laughs> do you number eight number do your friends on the weekend <laughs> it day they usually relax. They usually rest on the beach. Usually. Yes, they usually the relax on usually. the beach. On the beach. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. So they yes. usually relax on the beach. Yes. Correct. Okay. Correct. Yes. Hector? Hector? Easy. What do you do every day? What do you do every day, Hector? Uh, I am only work and study. I, I just work and study. Yes. Dígalo. I just work and study. I, I just work and study. Okay, Jonathan, what do you do every day? Jonathan, what do you do every day? You are muted. We cannot hear you. Creo que está apagado el micrófono, Jonathan. Sorry, teacher. No worry. Uh, first, I grab at seven o'clock. Mm -hmm. Then I take my shower. Mm -hmm. After that, I have my breakfast. Mm -hmm. Then I go to work mm -hmm. of um, food. Mm -hmm. uh, Perfect. I attend people at eight o'clock. Mm -hmm. I fix. Uh, Legal problems. Legal. Different. The, the, uh? Legal. 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 Uh, I fix legal problem. Mm, people. Um, I have my lunch at mm, 12 p.m. And finally, I go to bed at 11 o'clock. Thank you. Uh, Hael, what do you do every day? Uh, uh, what, teacher? Yes, what do you do every day? Mm, vamos a leer lo que escribimos. Um, well, I'm, I'm just asking you, like, what do you do every day? ¿Qué hace todos los días? Presente simple. Um, oh. I work. I work. I work. Uh, mm, I prepare in class. I prepare class. Okay. I prepare for the class. And mm -hmm. for the class, I teach the class. You teach the class, okay. Um, Get up. Solamente teacher. That's it. Okay. Very good, guys. Okay. 
All right, so we're going to stop right here. Erika, today we have the feedback, okay? So please stay with me, Erika. So the other ones, you may go. I hope you have a good night, rest. And if you have day off tomorrow, rest, but do your homework. Si tiene día libre mañana, siempre haga sus tareas de la plataforma, que no se le olvide, okay? I'll see you back on Thursday. Lo veo hasta el día jueves, yes? Yes, teacher. Good night. Good night, everybody. Good night. 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 Bye. Good night. Bye. Good night. Bye. Good night. Good night. Good night. Goodbye. 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 Good night. Good night. Okay. <laughs> okay, Clarissa. Good night. Bye, Clarissa. Okay. So, um, okay, Erika. So this time is for us to talk about how you feel with the classes, how you feel with um, the dynamic of the class, with the activities that we are doing, with the platform, if you have had some issues, if you have any question about any type of um, probably topic that we have covered. Um, well, this space is for you, for you to talk and for you to tell me what you think about the whole process, right? About the whole class and everything. First, I like the class because it's uh, I like when you may you when you do the the activities where where we can practice, and also I like how do you spray the grammar. Okay. I understand when you spray everything. Okay. Um. I I think. I don't know because maybe it's the first module. Module? A module. Uh -huh. uh, you speak Spanish. Right? Yes. Uh -huh. But I think then you're going to speak only English. Yes, that is correct. Yes. If you have noticed, we have many people that they do not speak. English at all, right? So it is kind of difficult sometimes because, I mean, since it is the first module, if we speak full English, they won't understand. Then what, 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 uh, what is going to happen is that probably they are going to get disappointed, right? And they are going to leave the class because they feel disappointed. So that's why we are like adopting this like 70% English and 30% Spanish and sometimes like this, right? So they can feel, I would say, uh, comfortable, right, with oh. the class. So, but yes, absolutely. Next module, which is the second or the third one, fourth one, full English. Okay. Okay. So yes, that, that is correct. Okay. This course is actually full English as well. But I have noticed that some of you do not speak English at all. So I cannot go ahead and explain everything in English because they won't understand, right? Mm -hmm. And the purpose is that they understand as well. So, yeah. So I do uh, like um, what I can do, right? To express uh, anything and everything, right? In, in, the, in a good way for them to understand mm -hmm. as well. Yes. But yeah, you're correct. Next module is full English. Okay. Cool. Yes. Okay, what about with the platform? Have you had any type of issues? No, teacher. Only the first time because I have problem with the email, but they can solve the problem. But after that, I everything is okay. Okay. And I like because, uh, uh, for example, the homework you made, you, you leave, I can practice uh, some grammar. Yes, that is true. Okay. Uh -huh. And also uh, the link you, may, you put in the Excel, mm -hmm. I can print oh. and I had the, the paper pa for okay. practice. Excellent. Okay, Erika. So now um, let me ask you something. What is the purpose um, for you studying English? What is the purpose? What is the goal that you have? 
for me, I would like to get a better job where mm -hmm. I can earn more money. Okay, perfect. So, and how long have you been learning English? I have maybe, I learned English maybe two years ago, but I came to finish and now I return the English because I, I think it's important to learn English. Okay, so do you really like English? Yes, I like. Yes, I can notice that you like English. Uh -huh, yes, I noticed that you like English. Okay, that is, yeah. that is really nice. And what do you think is the most difficult part of the English language for you? For me, sometimes the grammar. Okay. Uh, for example, uh, I confuse the, all the present, simple present, present continuo, all the, the tenses. The tenses is difficult for me. Mm -hmm. And sometimes the, the pronunciation, the some words. Okay, all right. So, yes, I think that uh, identifying all of the tenses is difficult, right? But you are going to learn a lot through this course because we have different like grammar parts, right? So you are going to understand most of those, okay? So in order for you to say, for example, you said, um, so I studied English two years ago, but I can continue. In this case, since it is past, you should say, but I couldn't continue. I couldn't. Hmm? Oh, okay. couldn't continue. Okay, couldn't. that is perfect. So in this case, um, do you have any question about any topic right now? Right now, uh, maybe in the first, I confuse with the, in the simple present when we use for example como redactar la la la, la oración okay uh -huh. pero ya después ajá, vi que usted explicó y después estuve i was looking so example and i got it a little perfect a little bit better okay excellent yes so the simple present is kind of easy but probably the most difficult part with the simple present tense is whenever we speak with the third person, right? Because we need to change the verb and the rules that we need to follow. You just uh, need to keep in mind that we use the simple present tense to talk about habits, uh, hobbies, daily routines, right? And that we have subject, verb, and complement. That is what you need to keep in mind. And I think that is going to be easier for you. Hmm? Yes, but right now you don't have any issues with the simple present tense or do you still have some doubts? Right now I don't have teacher because mm -hmm. the last class you saw some, some juice. Okay, perfect. All right. Okay, Erika. So my feedback uh, for you is the following, okay? So I have noticed that actually, yes, you're able to communicate with English, right? So you are able to use, um, I would say, different vocabulary, different phrases, and and because of, um, because of that, right, because you already have previous knowledge, um, of course, you participate more, and I can notice that you are able to communicate with uh, with your partner whenever you are like doing the activities in the breakout rooms in a good way, right? And that is pretty good. So um, maybe what I can tell you right now is that I really want you to to speak English with your partner, right? Whenever you are in the breakout rooms and you join full English, like, hey, hi, hello, how are you, right? Even though they speak in Spanish, you should speak in English, right? Because okay. they are going to see and they are going to say, hey, you, I mean, they are going to say, Erika speaks English because she knows, yes. But the thing is that if you know, then why you are not going to use it, right? Yeah. So you should use it and you should speak English with your partners. Uh -huh. So besides that, I just want to say congratulations because I can see that you are motivated, right? That you want to learn, that you participate, okay? And that is something really good that you are really professional and that you are really responsible, okay? And I want you to say thank you because that is something that we do value right? Okay. So continue like that, okay? Do not lose the focus, 
on the English language, okay? Keep studying, learning vocabulary. And if you have any question, you can ask, okay? You can ask me and I will go ahead and, and, and resolve any type of question that you may have, okay? Very good. So then the only thing that I want to say is that, that I really say thank you because you are a really great student, okay? Thank you, teacher. All right, Erica. So do you have any other questions, something that you would like to add up or something that is... um not clear right now? For example, uh, sometimes I try to to listen, for example, watch uh, movies in English, and I try to understand, but and also I uh, sometimes I try to learn more vocabulary, but sometimes it's, I think it's a little difficult because the, the way to how to the way to to write the word and then how to pronounce pronounce right the word is difficult. Yes, you know, maybe what I can recommend you for that, I don't know if you like this type of videos, but there are like a lot of videos um, that are about motivation, motivational videos, okay? So those videos have really good vocabulary, okay? So maybe you can watch one, uh, for three minutes or two minutes, and that won't be like really long, right? It's going to be short. So you can play it and you can add the subtitles, mm, right? Okay. Add the subtitles on YouTube and you will see that you will um, probably get more vocabulary. But yes, that's what I can recommend you. Mm -hmm. Try okay. to listen to videos on YouTube, but not like, I mean, yes, you need to focus on, on movies, okay? Mm -hmm. But focus also on those short videos about motivation, about probably, uh, for example, put uh, on YouTube, what is love, right? What is love? And they give you the explanation and you listen to how they explain the idea. What is friendship, right? What is, um, I don't know, any type of, you know, topic that comes to your mind, you can go ahead and, and look for those type of videos on YouTube. And that is going to be a good exercise for you. And you will see that you are going to get more vocabulary. And at the same time, you are going to be able to pronounce the words correctly, right? Oh, okay. So that is a good exercise that I can recommend you, okay? If you want to, to improve listening. And I can also share with you this page. You will see. Um, this page has a lot of material for listening, you will see. I'm going to send the, the link right here through the chat and I'm going to share my screen because I mean, this is something that, that is going to help you a lot, this page, okay? So I'm going to send the link here, okay? You just grab it or you know what? I'm going to add it right here, okay? I'm going to add it um, right here so you, you have it, okay? I'm going to add it here on the links, okay? Okay, teacher. Right here. I'm going to add it right here. Okay, so the thing is that, well, then you are going to come to this page, okay? And once you are in this page, you will see that we have general quiz. So you have easy, intermediate, difficult, interview, mm -hmm. academic. You have a lot of listeners. So if you want, you can start with the easy ones. Mm -hmm. Yes, and you have many topics look okay. at it so and let's say that you want to practice vocabulary about physical therapy you come here and you will have idioms oh. vocabulary explanation okay and you play the recording and you will hear okay you will hear it so hey what happened to you it's a long story. Okay, I love long stories. Well... Let me guess. You forgot your wife's birthday and she got angry. No. Actually, I was carrying some boxes down the stairs at home. And she pushed you? No. So, this is real English, right? <laughs> Once you listen to this audio, you have a quiz. Look at this. Oh, um, yeah. And you need to answer those quizzes. And now, you also have the listening script. So if you want, what you can do is play the, the audio and read at the same time. Uh -huh. 
and you have vocabulary and you also practice pronunciation. Okay. So this is a good website if you want to improve your listening, your vocabulary, and your pronunciation. Yeah. I okay. like because it's interesting because they had the audio and the the grammar. Vocabulary, the grammar, everything. Yes. Yeah. Okay, so I hope it helps. Okay, I'm going to add it here. I'm going to add listening. Okay, listen. And yes, all right. So I don't know if you have any other question. For the moment, not teacher. Okay, so just keep in mind that you have this link right here and practice, okay? Practice because you will see that you are going to improve a lot, okay? All right, very good. So if you don't have any other question, I'll see you back on Thursday. Thank you very much, Erica. Thank you, teacher. I hope you have a good night. All right, bye-bye. Bye-bye, teacher. Good night. Take care. You as well, thank you.